Okay, so it's finally been way, way entirely too long. 30 days of gaming, final installation, number 20, well, day 26 to day 30. Let's get started! Okay, day 26, best voice acting. Without a doubt, first, like, the character, the one character, like, just one. The one character with the best voice acting in any game, in my opinion, has to be your guys, you, your guys, your guys, your guys, you guys are going to make fun of me for it, but definitely without a doubt in my mind, my favorite, I mean, it's so nostalgic, it's just the best. It's like, all you did was grunt and moan, and that sounds so bad coming out of my mouth as I say it, but... All you did is grunt and moan and it is just like, you know, like so good. And that would be the two Japanese men who I'm not even going to pronounce their names. I'll probably put it up here in text somewhere, but it's got to be the two guys who voiced young and old Link, well, young and adult Link from Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. All he did was go, hiya, hiya, but oh my god, it was so good. Like, that's funny that the most annoying character in a game is Navi, in my opinion, but you gotta love her. And then my best voice acting came, best voice acting character comes from the same game. However, best voice acting overall in a game, definitely without a doubt, Red Dead Redemption. Everyone's voice in that game is point on, like spot on. It is so good. Overall, best voice acting of a game ever, in my opinion. So great. Like, not one character is below. Like, here's the bar, here's Red Dead Redemption, and not one character is below the original bar. Like, it's so good. It's so good. So believable. I love it. Um, okay, day 27 most epic scene ever. I took a lot of time to think about this and I've got to say most epic scene ever for me personally. I know there's a lot. I know there's some really good ones out there. But my favorite has to be the introduction of Sin in Final Fantasy X. Like with Titus and all the people running along the pier. Oh so so good. So good. I need I need to put a video. So if I do put a video of that, I'll put it here. If not, I'll just link somebody's YouTube video of it in the description. So that's what took so long. I was trying to get all this footage and I didn't yet. So bleh. <laughs> anyway, favorite game developer. I have a lot of favorite game developers. Probably the most recent of mine has to be Blizzard. I love Activision. Um, Idios, uh, nah, nah, nah. Now I forget all of them. Now that I'm actually doing this video, I completely forget. I loved 38 Studios. It's a shame they had to shut down. I want to know who was head of marketing because why would you release, like, that big of a full scale RPG, right? Like, maybe, what, three months after Skyrim came out? What were you thinking? You guys could have had this big epic game and it would have been so good. And they had plans. This is what makes me mad. 38 Studios had plans to release an MMORPG, much like Kingdoms of Amor, The Reckoning. And it would have been so good because that game, like, when it came out, everybody was like, oh my god, this would be so amazing as an MMO, and blah 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 blah. And it would have been if it would have sold more, but they released it around Skyrim and it failed. It failed. It didn't sell as much as it needed to. It sold, like, I think a third of what it was supposed to. Oh, but that game, that game is so good. If you haven't played Kingdoms of Valmor Reckoning, please, please have a t like, please test your faith with me and go and play that game. Find someone who bought it or go buy it yourself at like a secondhand store that sells video games or something. Buy it, play it. It's amazing. It's amazing. It's a good game. I still haven't beaten it. That's how big, like the world is so big I still haven't beaten it yet. It's good. Play it. Definitely. Definitely. Um, anyway. 
Day 29! A game you thought you wouldn't like but ended up loving. Oh. 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 Text message. What is a game? What, what game? What game did I have? I had a list. I had a list and it got deleted, I guess. I had a list. A game I don't think I would like, but I ended up loving. We'll just go with Wind Waker. Legend of Zelda Wind Waker. I thought it was going to be awful. So bad. But I played it and it was amazing. It was my, it's one of my favorite Zelda games ever. I don't know, now I feel like I... Let's see. I don't know. I don't know, I don't remember. We'll just go with that, I guess. Or... Maybe Smackdown? When I was a little kid, I played Smackdown. I was like, I'm gonna hate this game. And then with all the customization, oh, it was so good. I, it's one of my favorite games. I never thought I would love it that much. So I knew I'd kind of like it, but I didn't know it was gonna be like the best wrestling game ever that I've ever played. Like the original Smackdown or the second one. The second one you could play as a girl, I think, and create your own intros and stuff. That for me, it was like, yep, done. So. I've never played any wrestling games I've liked since then, so that's gotta be it. Gotta be! Um, and finally, last but not least, Day 30. Your favorite game of all time. Ooh. Oh, well, Day 29, a game that you thought you wouldn't like but ended up loving, Final Fantasy XII. I'm only like a third of the way through, I'm not even anywhere near being done with that game. But at first I hated it, I was like, what is this crap, it's so boring, it's taking forever. It took like seven hours to get any good gameplay. It's like half of the stuff that you can do in that game, you couldn't do for the first seven hours. And I mean, I was playing through pretty fast, I'm not a slow playthrough person when it comes to games like that. I mean, I do explore, but it's not, like, forever. And it was just... It's good, though. I, I really like it. Um, but anyway. Like, I'm just now in Palimpotum when, like, the guards, the guards come out. You know what I'm talking about. But anyway. Day 30, favorite game of all time. Oh, la, 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 la. Favorite game of all time. I don't. It's so hard to decide. It would have been, you ask, if you would have asked me like two years ago, it would have been, without a doubt, World of Warcraft. But I still have a love hate relationship with Cataclysm. Like, it should have been so many things. It should have been, it should have been amazing. It should have been the end all, say all, do all of gaming. But they killed my classes abilities and so it's just sad but now favorite game of all time it might still be world of warcraft <laughs> world of warcraft ocarina of time Le legend of zelda ocarina of time need for speed underground one or two can't go wrong with those games i love them um, Skyrim's pretty dope. Uh, Legend of Zelda Link to the Past. Oh, that was so good. Like, you could switch. There was the Dark World. Then you were the bunny if you played the flute. And oh, so good. That game. And the puzzles were hard. The puzzles were hard to figure out. That game. That game. Special place right in here. So one of those games I rambled off. And yeah, I decided I'm not going to go back in and put in, <laughs> my face got really white there for a second, um, from the lighting. Anyway, I decided I'm not going to go back in and put in that video, so I'll just link you guys in the description. And.
for the voice actors. I'm not gonna put their names up there either because that would mean I have to edit the video and I'm not gonna edit it. I'm just gonna go ahead and post this straight to YouTube so you can see all my nonsensical ranting and raving and idea formulating. And yeah! Yeah. I'm sorry I'm like so excited right now. I don't even know why. Probably because I'm finally done with this. I... I feel horrible in my heart places that it took so long for me to finish it, but I had big, I had big ideas, big hopes and dreams for this last video, but time constraints in real life issues in RL, IRL stuff, IRL, that's hard to say in this voice. Anyway, sorry, I'm putting my keyboard down, IRL stuff just got in the way. But yes, top 30, 30, 30 days of gaming, not top anything. It was a pleasure. I'm very thankful for all of you who watched. I'm glad I inspired you, some of you, to do this. It means the world to me. Thank you so much for sharing this with me. You guys are amazing. And yeah, I'm gonna go make another video for this channel, so... Be on the lookout for that, and thank you, thank you so much, you wonderful people. You are amazing. Really, really, you are amazing. Thank you so much. I hope you guys enjoyed the series. I'm sorry it took so long. I know I'm pale sauce, but you're gonna enjoy what I have in store for you soon. So. Be on the lookout. Okay, bye!